NFL Sunday, preseason week number three, Tennessee Titans square off against the New Orleans Saints Sunday, 2 p.m. Eastern time. This is the early game on Sunday. Last preseason Sunday is here. The next time we're talking about the NFL will be for the regular season. I absolutely cannot wait. I am jacked. I am pumped up. We're locked. We're loaded. We're making people a boatload of money and we're ready to go. Purpose of this video, point you in the right direction of where you should be betting for the preseason as well as put you on a free play as well. All right, guys, going over the line on this one, Titans, as of the time of filming this video on Friday, this video will be out Friday evening, uh, Titans still laying three and a half total, sitting at a high 36 and a half, a high 36 and a half. You catch the emphasis on the high part, right? All right, the Titans, they beat the Seahawks last week, 16 to 15, led by rookie kicker, uh, Neverson's three fourth quarter field goals for the Titans. Mason Rudolph, he looked good, I'll be honest. I'm not a huge fan of him, but he, he looked good. He went 10 of 17 for 125 yards. He did have four carries for 15 yards, and he had that one lone passing touchdown. Now, Malik Willis, he was 12 of 16 for 116 yards. He did throw that one interception as well. He did have four carries for 30 yards as well. Chestnut led the running department for the Titans, obviously. Uh, we ain't going to see the star players uh, even taking an opportunity to get injured. All right, so Chestnut led uh, in the preseason week number two with 13 carries for 45 yards. He did have two grabs for 29 yards as well. Uh, now let's talk about the Saints. Saints, they lost last week to the 49ers 10 to 16 we didn't see Derek Carr on the field um I'm not sure if we're gonna see him again this week uh he did Derek Carr things went seven of nine for 47 yards Spencer Rattler went four of eight for 27 yards he was sacked two times um they're saying he's 100% healthy now all right and expecting to see more Jake Haney he went seven of 13 for 76 yards Mims led the team in rushing with 10 carries for 37 yards while Williams and Robinson, as well as Hill, all had five carries apiece. Uh, Capote, he had six carries. They spread that run game offense out. They spread it wide last week, and I expect the same this week. Uh, Capote had that six carries, but he struggled. He had six carries for 10 measly yards. All right, lean on this one. Titans lane the three and a half. Lean. What is the lean? Lean is we're pointing you in the right direction. If you put it to my head and you said, Kyle, pick a side, I'd say take the Titans laying the three and a half. All right. However, your free play under 36 and a half. I'm not going to tell you to hammer it and pound it like I normally do a free play. Why? Because it's the preseason and we bet responsibly. So again, good luck to everybody. Wager responsibly. Don't forget on Sunday, we have our huge Sunday guarantee. Do not miss out. It's $50. It comes with that huge guarantee. Guaranteed to win or you'll get the next one free. If you're watching this video on Saturday, you can jump on board guaranteed. Saturday, UFC is priced at only $10 for the full fight card, $25 for the max fight pick. The max fight pick parlay makes a return as well this week. So guys, get on board. It is a monster making time and we're looking forward to helping each and every single one of you guys. Like, subscribe, follow, depending on where you're watching this video, uh, as well as do us a favor, drop a comment. What I wanna know, what's your best bet for the Titan Saints game? Good luck, everybody.